Nearly 20 million people are eligible to have their say on major amendments to the Constitution. Some of the changes include abolishing the death penalty and establishing greater social and legal rights. What are the guarantees of the Constitution? The referendum will solve citizens' political, social and economic issues. That's why the referendum on the amended Constitution was proposed. About 65 percent of the current Constitution will be altered. Mirzi Yoyev, who's been in power since 2016, presents himself as a progressive who's modernizing Central Asia's most populous country. There have been many changes in our country over the last seven years, and I believe there will be more changes in the future. The proposals would also increase the president's term from five to seven years. A two-term limit remains, but if passed, it would effectively reset the 65-year-old's time in office. With his second term set to expire in 2026, two more, longer terms could see Mirzi Yoyev govern until 2040. While some Uzbeks welcome the promise of reform, organizations such as Human Rights Watch still consider Uzbekistan a deeply authoritarian state, a country in which civil liberties, freedom of speech, and a free and independent media are curtailed. In recent years, Uzbekistan even adopted legislation that criminalizes any online criticism of the president. But every effort is being made to get people to the polls. We have sections for the voting process, for national and foreign observers, as well as for the media. We have set up four booths for voters, including one for those with disabilities. According to the law, if voters cannot come, we will take mobile booths to their houses. The result of the referendum is expected in 10 days' time. Michael Apple, Al Jazeera.